Hey! What's up guys? My name is Kel and welcome back to Let's Play Dark Souls 3 Quest for Platinum. I was gonna say let's play the quest for platinum. That's not quite it, man. Not quite it. So in the last time we got one of our trophies down, we uh ugh, gonna sneak past these assholes. We um got a ring, finished Arch Dragon Peak, killed Aldrich all in one run. It was a it was quite a good run. I think here I'm just gonna say fuck it. And I'm gonna try to run past these guys. Eh, maybe not. Maybe I'll kill this one. Come on. Ah, oh, crap! That didn't turn out so well. Now I'm gonna run past them. That's just four. What could they possibly do to my health? Eh, just take it down to a tiny sliver. It's not, it's no biggie. As long as we stay back, we should be fine. Don't want to aggro the, uh, the gargoyle, though. As you can see, we're wearing a little bit of a different setup today. I've got, uh, Morn's leggings, Black Knight gauntlets, uh, the Firekeeper robe, and the Lorien's helm. Let's get rid of that. And then, of course, our Yorushka's Triumph plus 10, Refined Dark Sword plus 10, and Black Knight shield plus 5. Figured we could use the Black Knight shield here because, um... Some of the enemies do fire, like those uh, fire bitches down there, and the uh, gargoyle uh, himself. Let's go Dark Moon Blade. Might as well do Tears in the Nile, just in case. Just in case. Alright, come and get me. Show me what you got. Show me what you got. It's coming up so much. As I play the the Witcher 3, like everyone says, show me what you got. And I just I immediately just think of that. This gargoyle got fucking shit on. Cleveland steamer style. Let's head up here. We'll get that bonfire and we'll head down. I think our ring is down there. The uh, profane capital ring. And then this time. When we actually fight Yorm, we're totally going to, like, actually equip the Storm Ruler before we go in. Um, oh, you know what? That, that reminds me. I should fucking level up the Storm Ruler. Where is the ladder? Here it is. Like, I should just go back to Firelink and level up the Storm Ruler. What's stopping me? You know what? Nothing. So let's do that right now. What's up, uh, Gilligan? Or Gillian? Not Gilligan. <laughs> Fuck, Gilligan's Isle. Uh, let's go back to Firelink. Let's level up our Stormwiller. Maybe we can't, actually. Hmm. Yeah, come to think of it, we might not be able to level up the Stormwiller. I think we can. What? But we might not be able to. Let's see. Uh, where would it be on this list? It should be like around here. So of all these dark swords. Oh wait, here we go. Yeah, Storm Ruler. We can't level it up. Titanite scale. Oops. No, no, no. Yep. Oh shit. We need one more scale. Fuck. We need a scale, yo. Pretty be careful. I think I know where we can get some scales, though. This is the first time I've talked to her. <laughs> uh, do you sell scales yet? Shit. Uh, give Umbral Ash. Here's some Paladin. Now, do you sell scales? Poopy. Oh, you know what? Oh, fuck. We never got... We never got Grey Rat. Alright, well, I know of one place we can go get a scale. So I'm gonna go do that real quick. It's it's actually gonna be pretty quick. It is there should be a Titanite Jabroni right here. And by Titanite Jabroni, I of course mean Crystal Jabroni. 
Because there are no Titanite demons in this game. But they're basically... They like say they serve the same function. Dark Moon Blade. Let's make it make it a little easier, why not? Why not use what we got? What's up, friend? Don't even think about it, man. Yeah, just don't do anything. That's the best strategy. Yay. Let's get the fuck out of here. Back to the shrine. Yeah, I'm doing this because I noticed that uh, when we fought him, or Yorm in New Game Plus, that eh, it didn't do quite as much damage to him. What? So it's not like a flat percentage. So might as well level yield Storm Miller up as much as we can. And yeah, slab it up. Slab it up. Pretty be careful. Cool. Now we can go back, and we can go get our ring, and we can go fight Yorm. Fight Yorm? <laughs> yep, we're gonna go fight Yorm. Uh, do, do, do no. Yes. All right. Okay, apologize. Uh, just yawned. I had to like, let, let, let go. I had to like hold it in. Well, like sort of pseudo yawn. If it was, uh, if you can hear it at all in the recording, I will, uh, I'll cut it out. All right. So the ring should be this way. I think. Like I said, I just have a list, and the list... Ooh, that's fucking sneaky. Magic stone plate ring. Nice. Alrighty, so... Proper way to go is up... So wait, no, it's not. No, it's not. It's the other way. By the other way, I mean... Back up this ladder, right? Can't just go this way, can I? Yeah, what the fuck am I smoking? I need to go up the ladder. Sorry, gargoyle friend. We're not we're not playing today. I mean, I technically am playing Dark Souls 3, but we're not playing with him. I did that all for the rusted coin. All right, and so the real way to go is we just leave the way we came in, right? It's been a little too long <laughs> since I've been back here. Yeah. Ye no. What am I even thinking? I honestly don't fucking know. All right, so we we come we come this way. It's not up there. That's optional. Yeah, you just dropped on the you just dropped down here, right? What the? F okay, okay, okay. I don't know why I'm so turned around. I I don't even know. So let's just take it one step at a time, and instead of just trying to remember arbitrary things because I'm playing so many different games. Let's just... Oh, fuck. Yeah, here it is. Okay. Jeez. All I needed to do was just head back up top. I've been playing a lot of games recently. And I normally focus on, like, one or two games, but, uh... For my... For my various Let's Play series, I've been... You know, I'm playing three games right now for that. Uh, Grand Kingdom. This... Uh, what are the other one? What's the other one? Oh yeah, o Odin Sphere. How can I think about Odin Sphere? That's one of the most fun games I've played in a, in a little while, in, in fact. I'm having a blast with Odin Sphere. But, I mean, also off-screen I'm playing uh, The Witcher 3, Blood Wine. I'm playing... Uh, I guess we're just gonna smack these bitches. Smack them around. How are you still alive? I'll 
I guess I'll take the coin. Yeah, Witcher 3, Blood and Wine, um, and I'm playing uh, Enter the Gungeon off screen. So, yeah, all good stuff. Here we go, Yorm the Giant. One of the several gimmicky fights for this, uh, for this game, but it's not a big deal. Do we still have fast roll? We do. Cool. And uh, the weapon art, or the special for the shield is the weapon art, so awesome. Ready. Whoops, that is a wrong attack. Oh, there you go. Oh crap, no, I have to be holding the weapon art down. I don't know what I'm thinking today. I I'm just full tilt. There we go. It up. I got the charge. Also, I don't know why I two-handed it, even though I don't need to. Your own buddy. Just take it, please. Charge it up again. Fire it off again. And charge it up again. He's probably gonna get a swing. Yep. Okay. I did hit the dodge. And it was, like, in good time with that. But you can't dodge while you're, uh, charging up. He's gonna walk beneath his legs. Ah, oh, he does have a, like, a, a stampy down. Whoops. Oh shit, that did a lot. Alright, well, see you later. Nope, guess not. Now see you later? There we go. That was sloppy. Very sloppy, but we, we got him. What boss has killed me? Oh yeah, the fucking... Crystal Jabroni killed me like... Two or three times? This playthrough? It's weird. He is much harder. Oh, New Game Plus Plus. Yeah, yeah. Alrighty. So let's not talk to her. And instead, let's equip our Dark Sword. Everything else looks pretty good. And let's go back and arrest the bonfire. Let's run past these jabronis. Whoop. So I think the next ring we're gonna get is in the Consumed King's Garden and then it's the Untended Graves and I don't think we're gonna be able to get that far in this episode but we'll definitely be able to get the Consumed King's Garden one. I imagine we'll be able to kill the Dancer and probably Osiris and I think I'm gonna use a summon for Osiris just to make him a little more or a little less annoying I suppose. Can I, can I get that far in 10 minutes? Hmm, no, no, probably. We'll see. Depends on how much uh, trouble these bosses give me. Dancer could could actually be trouble on a uh, on New Game Plus Plus. So, damn it, you fuckers! Are they gonna follow me into here? Nope. Cool. Well, let's uh, use our tears and get Dark Moon Blade ready. Prince Lothric is in your hands. Please save his soul. Yeah, I'll save his soul with my sword. What he must be a lord. Fucking kindling. Give it the old skip a rooney. Hello, my uh, defined budded. Firmly defined butted friend. Something something along those effects. Yeah, she's taking decent damage. Ow. Also kinda hits a little hard. I still remember playing the uh 
Ooh, staggered her. Playing the uh, stress test demo. And uh, the dancer, I like, was like kiting her around and throwing uh, knives at her. And uh, most of them like just hit her butt, so her butt looked like a giant pin cushion. It was, uh, it was pretty good. I'm gonna top myself off here. Whoop, that's gonna be a kind of a jukey attack. And you're probably gonna die here. Yep. Well, I took back what I said about it might be trouble. That was, that was quite easy. I think it's just because of my playstyle. It's like semi aggressive with uh, a focus on dodging rather than just blocking. It's more stamina efficient to, to dodge. Yeah, most The statue that cuts its own head off. We're gonna skip it. We ain't got time for that. It's still fucking awesome. Alright, so we're gonna go into the Consumed King King's Garden. And I think what we need to do is it says I'm gonna read out what my note says. Uh, from the dance of the Boreal Valley Bonfire, climb the ladder and head left. Once outside, follow the path to a lift and jump off halfway down. Head left and fall onto a platform. I think I know where this is. I think I know where this is. You can hear the uh, dragons up at the uh, dragon barracks ahead. What's up, dude? Oh, I totally could have backstabbed him right there. Come on. There we go. Two kicks. That's all that it takes. We got up quickly. Yep. Third kick's the charm. I stabbed him right in the dick. Poor, poor guy. Alright, so we're going to be looking to jump off. I don't remember exactly where. Oh, it looks like it's right here. Alrighty, and it should be around here somewhere. I don't think this is it. Nope, definitely not. Let's see. Oh, shit. Is it... Is it that? Wait, how the fuck do you even... Hold on. Jump onto the adjacent platform to where the ring is. It's not this, is it? Oh shit, no, it's this! Oh god, this is gonna be sketchy as fuck. Okay. Alright, how, how are we gonna do this? Fuck. Oh, you know what? It was probably better to drop down onto that little lip and walk over. I don't know if we can make this jump. Oh, I made it! Awesome. Alright, well, I fucking crossed that one off the list. So now we only have three more to go. Untended Graves is the next one. And then Lothric Castle and Grand Archives. Let's see, the Lothric Castle one is near the Dragon Slayer armor. And then the Grand Archives one is uh, near the three Golden Knights. The Wing Knight dudes. Alright, so for here, I am just going to run straight on through. Straight on through to the other side. Oh, we, we don't have uh, Hawkwood because we've never talked to him. <laughs> That's good. Uh, let's see. Did we did I accidentally, accidentally aggro one of these guys? Oh, it's that guy. I was saying I, I can hear someone casting spells. Well, I guess we're not doing Hawkwood. Uh, what kind of shield do we want? We probably just want our uh, Wolf Knight's shield, huh? And can I just run past these guys? Fuck, I, I just kind of want to. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. Whoa! Whoa, no, no! Oh, fuck. I knew I was gonna get hit by that. 
These guys are a lot quicker than I remember. I don't care though. Just haul ass to the fog wall. This isn't Dark Souls 2. They wanted it to prevent you from doing things like what I just did. Come on. Don't put baby in a corner. God damn it. Boss is so janky. He's like the definition of janky. You were born a child of Christ. Everything about him is janky. <laughs> like the room is janky. He looks janky. He's got fucking janky tendrils on his crotch and legs. His not baby. Though just wailing on him like that was seemed pretty good. He's gonna do a sweep. Ow. I'm gonna heal up here. There he comes. Ouch. Fuck, man. I am surprised that, that didn't hit me. I'm just gonna go to town on him, except for the part where he just ran away. I'm gonna do a sweep. I can get a couple hits on him here. And now he's dead. The <laughs> Dark Sword, everyone. Fucking Mash L1. Pro skills. The pro skills, mashing the L1. Alrighty. What are we for time? Can I do fucking untended graves too? Uh, I don't know. I don't know if I can kill Gundir that quick. But then again, he's weak to lightning. So I could just do lightning blade and try to go to town on him. I don't know. I'm pretty iffy on this one. I definitely can make it to him in like one or two minutes. That's not a problem. The problem is going to be like just killing him. Because I, I do think he's one of the harder bosses in the game. And then again, we did beat the Nameless King pretty easily. Who I think is the hardest boss in the game. No, I don't care about you. I don't even remember what's in those things. And frankly, it doesn't matter right now. We have everything we could possibly need. And the ring here is located, let's see, it's located in the Firelink Shrine area, behind one of the, the tombs, or, but not tombs, thrones. Tomb. Uh, we're going to attune Lightning Blizzade. What was the one that we just got? We got, like, is Lightning Storm? Fuck, we can't even cast it. 45? Alright, still have our uh, tears of denial on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for it. Let's do it. Let's kill, uh, let's kill Gunder now too. I'm a champion. When I grow up, I'm gonna kick that ball ten thousand yards. You could do it, Whittle Brother. I don't know if anyone's gonna fucking get that. It's a Whittle Brother, and it is a reference to a old ass Homestar Runner skit. I believe. Oh shit, I forgot about her. I forgot about you, Crystal Majama. Mamma Jamma. Once again, none of this matters, because I'm just running straight into the boss room. And I don't think they can follow me in here. Haha, <laughs> laugh at you. They're all gonna laugh at you. Alright, let's do Lightning Blade. And go greet Gundir. Smack him in the ass a little bit. Eh. The damage he's taken is not insignificant. Oh crap. Oh no! I've never seen him do this! I've never seen that move. Double heal. Wow, I've definitely seen that one a lot. Yeah, I've never seen that grab. That's gnarly. I guess he's just never hit me with it. Yeah, 
Here, I want to top myself off here. Two hits in. Then back off a little bit. Dodge. Get two hits in. Oh, he's going to stomp. Swing. Yeah, I expected a kick. I was, I was thinking shoulder, but I knew it was going to be one of his, his uh, quick melee type attacks. Ooh, don't, don't want to get near the edge. Don't want to get knocked off. That would be tragedy. Alright, there we go. I think we can get him here. God damn it, fucking kick! Dodge forward. Smacky smacky. And he's dead. Man, pretty easy. I, I've fought these bosses enough, I suppose, that they're just... I don't know. Like, it comes with reflex and just knowing the patterns and... It's not bad. It's not bad. I mean, also, I've played all of the games and... multiple times and... I'm not terrible at these games, is, is what I'm trying to say. I'm not super good either. I mean, there's some people on the internet who are way better than me, but... For someone who doesn't dedicate most of their time to these games, I think I'm alright. I play them a decent amount, but I also play a ton of other games. Like, I think it was in this episode I listed off like the four or five games that I'm currently playing. Alright, so the thing that I need... Well, this is a free Titanite slab if I need it. But the thing that I really need is up here... And it should be behind this. Plus three? Sweet, that's the only plus three ring, the life ring plus three. Cool, and I think that's it for here. So let's, uh, I guess we'll work back to the shrine and then work back to uh, the dancer. Brief interlude. Uh, dancer, dancer, dancer. Oh, it's weird that Osiris is in the high wall. Like, it's in the same one as, like, the tower of the wall. Did I? Hmm. I was gonna say, did I realize that? I'm pretty sure I did. Alright. So I think we're gonna end the episode here. In the next episode, we are going to go straight into Castle Lothric. Castle Lothric. Um, and get what we need to get there. We are only two rings away. And two trophies away from Platinum. We're, we're very close to the end. I think I'm calling maybe two more episodes after this. And, uh, and then the series is done. And I'll probably be done with Dark Souls 3 for at least a little while. Unless I want to do some extra PvP or something like that. I don't really like the PvP with the whole lag stabs and all that shit. Um, I, I like my combat to be very responsive. Like, I can't play, like, laggy fighting games either. I'm... I'm Kind of into finer games, too, if you didn't know that. Anyway, um, if you like the video, then maybe maybe leave a like. Maybe even subscribe. Every little bit helps, and I appreciate it oh so very much. Um, regardless of what you do, thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see you next time for one of the last episodes of The Quest for Platinum. See you later, guys. Also, I forgot to do a thing, and I think I forgot to do one in the last episode, too. So all I can do is clap at my forgetfulness.